Real life Rocky story. Leon Rocky Edwards grew up in a wooden shack in Jamaica surrounded by crimes and gangs. He was a good kid but routinely fought in school and became desensitized to the shootings around him. At the age of 9, he and his family moved to another hostile environment in Birmingham where his father would be fatally shot in a nightclub. This pushed him towards gang and crime until the age of 17 where he came across an MMA gym and luckily fell in love with the sport and 6 years later would make it to the UFC. He lost his debut via split decision, then got an 8 second knockout, got a UD win, and then would meet the Nigerian Nightmare for the first time. It was a good fight, but Leon was very young and didn't have the wrestling skills to beat Kamaru. But Leon would go on to have a fantastic unbeaten streak with wins over names like Vicente Luque, Cowboy Cerrone, Gunnar Nelson, RDA, and Nate Diaz. This all led to his first title shot against the man he lost to before, and aside from a very impressive first round, Leon was losing the fight. But Rocky doesn't give up, and in the last minute of the fight, we all know what happened.